Hello! Welcome to Technique Course Tutorials. In this video, I'm going to show you how to add widgets on your webinar on Webinar Loop 2. Let's begin! On your webinar's dashboard, click on Webinar Setup button. And on the sidebar section, click on Widgets. To add widgets, click on Add Widgets button. You can select different kind of widgets like poll, information, image, a call to action, or a question. Now, for example, I want to add a poll. Click on it and type in your poll question. Then the options for the answer, like yes or no. Then if you want to add another option, click on this button. And if you want to delete it, just click on the delete button on the side. Then for the button text, let me add in vote. And then there's a timer here. It will show this poll after 4 seconds. And when you're done, click on the Add button. And your poll widget will be added successfully. And your attendees can vote on it. Now if you want to add information, just do the same steps. Click on Add Widget and select Add Information. For this one, enter in the information message you want to show. You have 65 characters to use. And again, set in the timer. Mine will show after 7 seconds. Then again, click on Add. And here's the information widget that will show. It also shows the timer. Now let's add in an image. Click on Add Image and choose your file. Then add in the heading title. Mine says Webinar Loop Image. And for the timer, this one will show after 10 seconds. And you can add redirect link. So when your audience or attendees click on this link, they will be redirected to that. Then add your widget. And here's the image we have added as a widget. Now let's add in a call to action. Enter in the call to action heading. You have maximum characters of 250 to use. Then your heading title. And also enter in the text you want to show on the button. So my attendees will just click on the button to get the free CRM. And then add in the bottom link and again, Set in the timer. Then click on Add. And here's the call to action widget. Now for the last widget, let's add in a question. Type in the question you want to ask and the timer for it and the button text. Click on Add. And your widget will be added successfully. Now here on the top part, you can change the heading colors. You have a lot of options to choose from. And you will see it right away. And also for the button color, like so. And to see your widgets, on the top right corner, click on Join Attendee Room button. Then log in. And here is the webinar. In a few seconds, you'll see the poll will pop up. Here it is, followed by the information, the image, the call to action, and the question widget. You can even test it out. Answer the poll or the question. Then if you click on submit, you will see that it will be successful. And if you click on the button for the call to action, it will direct you to a link that you have placed. And that is how you set up your webinar widgets on Webinar Loop 2. And that is it for today's video. I hope you find this video helpful. Thank you for watching and see you on the next one.